Yeah, I guess where's everybody getting deals from? I'm, I mean, I've been doing it some MLS, some word of mouth, some signs and stuff, but just curious where everyone else is getting them right now. D, all the above. It's, yeah. Uh, it's a combination approach, Nick. It's, you know, some of that old fashioned organic marketing where you're doing the dial and smile and calling people and say, I'll take your garbage for you. You don't want it. I'll pay you a referral fee if we do anything with it. Um, there's, of course, the outbound call center we, we do. We call every day and, you know, we get people raising their hands saying, yeah, I'm interested in talking. Um, and then we get, you know, a lot. Uh, now we're starting to get a lot from Facebook. So uh, one thing I thought of today was, do you guys, are you guys like mailing and emailing and calling realtors to get their junk? No, that's a more of a belly to belly type approach. Um, I, what I recommend is you call them up, introduce yourself and do it that way. Okay. Now you can, you, I mean, you can email them and you can send them a letter, but the best thing is going to be if you end up talking to them directly and, uh, you know, getting them on the phone and, 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 or in, you go to one of these meetup meetings or a local yep. meetup meeting and say, listen, I'm the, I'm the garbage guy. You guys got stuff that you pay to market for. And then, you know, these, these folks will, uh, you know, respond to you and then you can't do anything with them because there's not enough equity or whatever. Sure. You take those things, you know, you'll take out their garbage for them and you'll give them a thousand bucks for each deal that you end up doing. And most of them are happy to do that because these are things that they've spent money to get the phone to ring. They can't do anything with. So, yeah, perfect. All right. Well, cool. I'm good then. Yeah. So I, I would, I'd work all of them. Nick. I, you know, I would, I'd work all angles at one time. The nice thing is to have multiple streams of marketing going so that you've always got, you know, and I like a combination of inbound and outbound, both, you know, where you're out there chasing after some stuff and some stuff's chasing after you. It's just a better mix because, you know, over the long cycle, stuff will tend to go up and down and that type of thing. And if you're doing, you know, three or four different marketing methods, if you can, if you've got the bandwidth to handle that, you're just going to be in the winner's circle a lot quicker and more often and with bigger dollars. Cool. Keep after it, man. I will. And uh, yeah, don't forget to hit up Blair on that, you know, exactly some of those other, I think uh, my, my plus leads, I think is one of them that he uses. And uh, there's a couple of others that uh, he does, but Mojo has the, the bulk of what you're probably going to need. You may okay. have to expand your geographic base a little bit more. You may have to go to full counties instead of zip codes. You may have to even, you know, do parts of states or MSAs are a good way to go. And you get some bigger numbers when you do an MSA. Thank you.